All right, folks, welcome back to another Newbie Views. This week, we are heading back to a pizza joint. We are going to go to Tony's Pizza. They have slices, they have pies, they have everything. It's Kingston's West End, so uh, let's go get some slices and review them as well. So, off we go. Okay, folks, here we are. We are at Midland on Princess Street. Just gonna pass Midland in a few seconds. Guys, there you go, Tony's Pizzas, buy the slice, let's go get some. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back from Tony's Pizza. Lunch hour specials, got a couple of slices. Uh, let's do a close up on it. Let's see what we got. All right, going in for the close up, guys. Oh, okay, so here we have the pepperoni bacon, a little bit different from Tata's, they use bacon crumble, still looks darn good though, well actually I don't know if it's crumble, there's some pieces of bacon there, maybe it's a mixture of both, and it's okay. And here is their all dressed, which looks like green peppers, mushrooms, pepperoni at the bottom. Well, only taste will tell which is better. Let's check the undercarriage while we're here. Oh, good undercarriage. Well done. Well done. Now, I can tell you right now, I literally just came into the shop. It's only 11, can't tell. It's only about 11. Sorry, it's only about 12. So they had a full rack of pizza. This could be sitting around for a little while, but uh, let's have a quick close up. So bacon, pepperoni. Wow, no flop. Good undercarriage. One bite. Everybody knows the rules. I'm going to take a quick bite. Actually, let's get some Instagram before I do this. Hold on. Okay guys, here we go. Tony's Pizza, got a couple of slices. 9.75 for both, so one's like 4.25, one's 4.50 or 4.75, something like that, four bucks. So, bacon, pepperoni. Mm-hmm. I can see like a lot of bacon crumble, but they're not big bacon pieces. Well, they're just bacon pieces. I wonder if it's a mix of crumble and bacon. <laughs> well, this bacon, hmm. This is like bacon fluff. Is that just such a thing, bacon fluff? It doesn't really have that much of a bacon flavor. Not as opposed to 
Yeah, I wish it was like bacon strips. Okay. No, I feel I taste it better now. Yeah. It's good. But the value of the slices, look how big this is for four bucks. Four twenty five, four fifty, something like that. Let's check the crust out. It's okay crust. I it's just regular crust. I'm not a big crust fan as you know, but now the pepperoni. It doesn't have any distinct flavor, it's just pepperoni. They put their pepperoni right on the dough, cheese on the top. I think a lot of places do that from old school. They're not on the top that's going to dry out when it's baked. Mm. Very enjoyable. Okay. That was the bacon pepperoni. And the one, and the one I'm most interested in is the all dressed. So this is classic. Pepperoni, mushroom, green peppers. You saw this? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. You can really taste the mushrooms. I love mushrooms. Oh, yeah. Oh. That's fantastic. Yum. Mm. And they're all dressed. They also throw in bacon bits as well. Although I can't really taste it. <clears throat> Value wise, under ten dollars, two bigger slices. Mm. Good amount of cheese. Can see the profile in this fairly thin crust. It's holding up well. There's not a lot of flop. Now this has cooled down a bit since it took me five ten minutes to get here but oh it's very tasty I like it a lot mm. I need a beverage show the logo it's not sponsored but Pepsi if you're looking coke is knocking on my door if you want to sponsor me Pepsi if you want to sponsor me first Come first serve. Coke is knocking on the door. Let's uh, let's take a bite. Let's have a drink. Let's have a sip to clean the palate. <clears throat> Sorry. All right, final thoughts. Well, value, it's under $10, $9.50 or 25 or something like that for the two slices. Pretty big slices that came in this container. Pretty standard, big, large size container. So the comparison has got to be how good is the pizza compared to somebody else. It's a good mom and pop shop. I was in there within like 15, 20 seconds, I was out. Like their entire rack of pizza was already filled, ready to go. It probably could do with a bit more heating. You'd want to throw it in the oven for two or three minutes at 350, just to crisp it up, just to get it warmed again. But it was warm. Uh, flavor wise, no complaints. A good old Italian style restaurant. Only thing I would complain about is bacon. I wish it was real bacon bits. Uh, sorry, bacon slices instead of bits. I could taste everything. It had less flavor than some other vendors out there, but on par. So, good pizza. Okay, so everybody wants to ask the question, how good are they compared to every other pizza joint out here? 
I'm gonna say this is also one of those A tier pizzas on the right day, fresh out of the box, A tier pizza. This is one of those go-to old school pizza joints. If you get it cold like I did, it was a little cold, so it's a B tier right now. Doesn't mean it's bad, it's just that it was cold. I didn't wanna heat it up, so there you go. So that's the review, guys. Tony's Pizza, address in the link below. If you like this video, guys, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. S turn on your notifications so you know when our next video comes out. And go ahead, give me a comment below. What other pizzeria would you want to see reviewed as well? So Tony's so far, four out of five, a B plus. I would go out and get it for sure. I'd want to get a full pie though. That's, that's what I want to get. All right, that's it for now. Until next time, peace out.